Okay, first question. Wash, any temptation to let Martin try to finish that or just too early to for that? No, it wasn't any temptation. He had given us what he needed to give us. Uh, I think he was at 111, 112 pitches right there after the eight. Now that's why we had uh, Ogando ready to go. I do know that, sorry, it's the last two nights. Is that the reason why you went with Ogando or is there something else? No. Sorry, I pitched the last two nights. Drew, well, what did you think of? Our team today obviously got a lot of double plays again when he needed them. Well, once again, his forte is keeping the ball down. He had a good changeup working today, good breaking ball. He was able to spot his fastball down in the zone where he wanted it. And um, he was able to make pitches when he had to. And that was the reason for the double plays. Uh, he just continued to, to grow. And once again, we're watching it in front of our eyes. Watch, obviously, Donnie Murphy was in there because Elvis got thrown out. Two things. What did, it, what did Elvis get in trouble for throwing the batter? Did he say something? And then talk about Murphy coming through and getting a big well, RBI for you. He was warned for throwing the bat, and then he did say something. So um, you can get it from Elvis, what he said. <laughs> what about Murphy, though? What well, you Murphy, uh, you know, he and Josh Wilson have been doing a great job. And um, he came up big there with that sacrifice fly. Josh got on the bag, Chew fought the left thing, got a base hit, put us at first and third, and um, you know, Murphy hit that ball. I thought maybe it may have had a chance, but the wind was a little tricky today, kept it in the ballpark. But uh, did an outstanding job, and they played some great defense too. Well, as you know, during spring training, we waste a lot of time talking about the 24th, 25th man on the roster, uh, but those kind of guys have come through for you uh, lately, haven't they? No doubt about it. And, um, you know, as I keep saying, we got Murphy toward the end of spring training, well, the last day. But uh, Josh was with us, so we had a chance to, uh, you know, get to see what he was about. And, I mean, the key for us is to make sure we try to keep him in position where they can be successful. And, um, you know, those two guys have been a savior up the middle. Uh, you can see today they played the heck out some defense. And I love that. Kuzmanoff's been okay, too. Kuzmanoff is a professional. He knows how to play. Once again, those three have come in handy for us uh, because certainly there were other guys we, we expected to be out there, but uh, they stepped in and, and done a good job. Got to give them credit, which I never doubted the job that they were doing defense man. Jerry, Wash with Wilson and Murphy, is that what you stress the defense and any offense you get from them is like they see icing on the cake? Defense and um, execution of fundamentals. That's it. Hey, Wash, when you talk about Martin growing up, what is it that you see in the difference last year, this year, in terms of executing the time? Well, that's what it is. Execute. Um, Keeping the ball in the bottom of the zone, which is what he does very well. And he continues to do it. That's, that's how he rattled off the games that he rattled off last year when he was on a little roll. And he comes back and he perfected his change up much better. He's able to throw his curveball behind in the count. Um, and his, his sinker is working good. And once again, because he throws the ball down in the zone, that makes him more effective. As long as he can get the strike zone, and he does hit the strike zone in the bottom part very well. You got Chirinos and throwing those guys out. Did he just talk about how important those two plays were there? Well, they were real big because uh, you never know what may happen if they reach second base. But, uh, you know, Chirinos, i got to give him a lot of credit for all the work he's done. And, um, you know, it's been showing. He's certainly improved his game behind the plate. He's improved his game offensively. And he's improved his game as far as the middle part of it, working with the pitchers. And um, understanding the guys on the bases and what he has to do. And I think uh, Molina and uh, Hector has done a heck of a job with, with him, uh, you know, making him the, the receiver that he is. Hey, Wash, can you talk about, they were mentioning the press box, the first time ever you guys have had two one to nothing wins in the same series, which is amazing with this team. But can you comment on that a little bit? Well, it's pitching. You know, our young kids are starting to get a little better. And um, they're starting to get out there and, and fight a lot harder in certain situations. And the whole idea is just to match zeros. And, um, you know, it was a, two low scoring games, but uh, that's because they had good pitching out there. Although it was the Houston Astros, those young kids, they got control of baseball. And they're showing the improvement they have, and we're also showing the improvement we have. Um, you know, with 
Seattle coming in, we certainly going to have to put some more runs on the board. But if we have to play in these type of ball games, and uh, my pitchers continue to get strong because of these type of ball games, I'll take them all the time.